welcome back to the next uh, tutorial uh, today I'm going to show uh, how to dem download the uh, global surface water data of the whole uh, old or you can download the particular area uh, so uh, this data you can use for the special variation uh, of the different uh, uh, reaches like the flood prone area wetland uh, drought lake pond and uh, here you'll see with the different uh, uh, data types also uh, so you uh, so this tutorial will also help you to know about the not only the spatial distribution but uh, you can also find the different uh, dynamics of uh, the water occurrence here uh, so uh, i hope you like this video uh, so let's get started uh, with this tutorial okay so you can google here with the global uh, water surface So you see this interface click on this now you see here uh, interface of the surface water data uh, now you can click here on the explore now here you can open the interface which will show the water occurrence uh, change intensity, water seasonality with the reoccurrence with the different background layers. So here, uh, this is the water occurrence uh, data from the 1984 uh, to 2021. So here you can change the uh, background layer here, uh, or can also see with the old map uh, satellite layers here and with the white background layers so you can zoom it to see the clear picture so again uh, for the water occurrence intensity uh, you can click on here so this shows the water intensity here and you can go with the different uh, background layer to visualize it properly so here uh, this is a time lapse frame so this shows the water intensity uh, so if you see on the satellite layer or you can also see on the uh, white layer and the water intensity throughout the old so in this way you can also uh, check the water seasonality, uh, water occurrence changes as per the season. You can uh, on it first. So change it with the background layer. You can put it here with the earth time lapse here. Or you can use with the satellite layers. the white layers uh, so these types of uh, data will help to visualize different uh, lake area pond area or it can be used for the different uh, research or related to the water like the flood prawns wetland density uh, drought period uh, so um, for the water annual water reoccurrence uh, you can click on this as well and since the background layers uh, you can visualize it with them so if you see in the satellite also so in this way you can uh, visualize the different uh, water intensity charts here throughout the world. so if you see the water transition look with the uh, different uh, index here
so you can visualize it here properly here in the satellite view or you can also see on the uh, white view so if you go on this uh, icon you can see the description here so you can see here uh, different information related to this uh, profiles so again if you see, go with the uh, annual water occurrence so you can found the detail with here So on the seasonality as well you can uh, found the details of the seasonality as of the 12 months of the each year on the occurrence also uh, you can found the overall uh, water dynamics with the intra or inter annual variability and uh, different characterization of the water dynamics over the period so if you see this also so in this way you can uh, found the different information with these interface uh, changes of the uh, water intensity water occurrence or the different uh, seasonality period here so So after this, uh, you can uh, download the global surface water data of your research area for the free. So here, go with first interface uh, and go down here and go get them. Now you'll see here uh, the uh, data user guidelines with the data download option here so you can download this data user guide and you can found the information of it here with the water occurrence and intensity changes here similarly with other seasonality occurrence so um, yes, you will get um, uh, regarding information here with these different uh, data form with the different symbology and their value okay so let's get uh, download the data here mm, okay now for to dem download the data here uh, you can select uh, the specific location here with the different tires uh, so you'll see the different data of, of the occurrence and seasonality with the recurrence and the maximum extent here with the symbology file and the metadata you'll see the different uh, of the data format now I'll click this one this tire now you see your occurrence now let's um, click on this uh, now your data will download here so your data get downloaded here Let's get to the GIS data. Okay, this one occurrence here. Let's edit. 
Klik S. So, in this way, you will uh, can get the data of the surface water. So, if you click on this, you will see the different symbology here. So, uh, and so you can work with your surface water data for the different ratios. I hope you like this tutorial. Uh, thank you for watching.